Your current exhibition, 40 Acres, The Promise of a Black Pastoral, sounds pretty unique. Tell us a bit about that. We have an interesting collection. Our, our founding collector, Randolph Lindsay Simpson, gave us photography, artifacts, historical material, fine art, uh, you name it, advertising mm -hmm. material as well. And so we were able to tell a lot of great stories. Mm -hmm. I like to think of it as aestheticizing history. And this is an opportunity to look at some of the current debates around reparations and the role of black farmers and the history of blacks in agriculture and mountain exhibition to tell that story, which is what we've done. Aside from photographs and sculpture, what other media uh, at the exhibit would tell the story of the black agrarian experience? We have an amazing piece by uh, the artist Hank Willis Thomas. He did a residency with us in 2009 at the Wadsworth and the Amistad Center and found our postcard collection fascinating. And he developed an installation. It's a plexiglass house of cards, and it's 600 postcards from our collection from the late 19th, early 20th century. And it's a point when African Americans were in the Reconstruction era attempting to establish new lives and create a new reality for themselves as farmers and, farmers and landowners. Mm -hmm. At the same time, we see the beginnings of the incredible stereotyping of African-American history and culture in the years after slavery. So as people are creating new lives and telling new stories about who they wanted to be, the world around them is saying, no, this is the world we think you should represent. This is the old South we want to hold on to. So it's 600 postcards, uh, some of them of some really, really tough images mm -hmm. that were mailed out into the world. 